Yes, ma'am. I need to do two things here. First, I need to get obtain the records for two case numbers. Can I record them down? One of them still, so which is uh, a one that's 17 0369 CV. Yes, ma'am. And the other one is criminal 01 92 uh, 00617-CR. And this is what I need to do. I need to uh, view the transcript on appeal like the court reporters could do. On the CD, and I guess if you can for this one as well, but I want you to verbally tell me, do you see a judgment on docket sheet? You won't. There's no, I, I know the answer to these questions. I just need you to tell me verbally. Uh, I'm asking you, do you see a judgment on? On that docket sheet. Well, that case we're not going to have because it's an old case. What you mean? We have to order from storage. I'm not, I don't need you to order. I just, I just, you have, you already have the record in the system, the docket sheets. I'm just asking you, do you see a judgment on that docket sheet? I already know the answer to this question. Okay, how can I help you, sir? Yes, she's going to, I'm asking her for, uh. Ask me, sir. I need to know for cause number, docket number 01-92-00617-CR, whether or not uh, you see a docket file in this record. Whether I see what? A docket, I mean, I'm sorry, a judgment file in this record. What do you mean a judgment? You're going to have to be more specific, sir. I'm, the, the judgment of the Court of Appeals affirming the lower court judgment of the trial court. You you should see an opinion. You should see a man. Sir, bear with me just a second. You're asking a question. Let me look through the system to see if I can locate it, okay? Yes, sir. Okay, bear with me just one second. Sure. Can I show that there was an opinion issued on this case August 26, 1993, sir? Okay, and what about the mandate? The mandate was issued in this case on March 9, 1994. What about the judgment? The judgment was issued at the time the, man, the opinion was issued in conjunction with the opinion. No, there's no judgment on that docket sheet. Sir, He's sir, already... we, don't, uh, we operate the way we operate. No, sir, this is what I'm saying. Yeah, I'll... Allow me to speak, sir. I've allowed you to ask your question. The opinion and judgment were issued at the There was time. no judgment. That's why there I was the judgment issued. No, sir. Okay, I'm not going to argue. I'm not asking sir. you to argue. I'm just telling you, sir, we've, I've already got the docket we sheet. Not, we do not put a separate entry in our system. Let me call out, sir. Allow me to speak. Or I'll call the security and we'll ask you to leave. Okay. okay I'm trying to answer your question. You're not answering. Okay, sir. Let me just. That's okay, sir. I already. Allow me to answer your question. You're not. No, you're saying that you looked at the court's docket. I have the file. I just sure. wanted you to you see. Me? Look, I'm sending this to the Supreme Court. I already have the file. You allow me to finish sure. This, okay. Without interrupting you. Okay. Sure. Okay. You're saying that you looked at the court's web page and looked. At no, the no. I, my daddy went in, in in 2006 and obtained the whole file. Mm -hmm. So I already know what's in the file. I'm doing like God. I'm asking questions that I already know the answers to. No, you're I, not because you're asking the wrong question, sir. You're asking me if the court issued a, issued a judgment. And yes, the court issued a judgment. You was not and working at this court at that time. Yeah, I was. N not in, you, you worked for the 14 court appeal. This was the first court appeal. The clerk of this court was then Ms. Margie, T uh, Ms. Margie, what's his name? Okay. Yeah, okay. Uh, when the record came down, see the whole record has been sent to the state uh, library. It's been sent to the Texas Court of Criminal Appeals on direct review. It's been sent on. Uh, Do you have a question, sir? Sir? Do you have a question? I, 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 I that's what was my question. I just wanted to. The, the clerk's office, because Mr. Chris, Mr. Uh, the, Mr. Prime has already said it wasn't a judgment. So I don't know why. I said, okay, anyway, sir, I would like to get the, uh, the the CD for the criminal matter and the CD for the civil matter so I can send this to the FBI and the Supreme Court of Texas. request for that, sir. We'll have to order it. And there's a $25 fee for retrieving each one of those files. No, I didn't, say re I didn't say the file. I said the CD that I come here often to review. Okay, but you want a copy of that? You would have no, to I don't want a copy of the CD. 
I just want to go in this room, pull what I'm looking for, get it to the sprinkler, and they'll be out. That's all I want to do today. Okay, but what do you mean, pull what you're looking for, sir? Okay, this is what I mean, sir. When I come here, when I go to the full, first four appeals, they'll present me with the CD. If, if you will just give Mr. Prime, he'll he knows how what I what I'm doing here. But I yeah, see, I just need the CD, so I go in here and review. You need to provide me on a piece of that paper. is right there. Okay. These are the two cases that you yes. would like to look at on the CD. Yes. Okay, sir. If you want to have a seat out front, I'll let the first court know. They can prepare that for you, and we'll make it available to you to look at in there. And finally, so would you ask Mr. Prime to come down, sir? I can handle any questions you may I'm, have. No, no, I'm not. I just would like to speak to the clerk because he's already stated, so I just want to get this to the first court, I mean the Supreme Court, that he's already told me. I got him on YouTube already saying that there's no judgment. So I don't know why you would try to say that there is a judgment. I said that there's a, a judgment issue. That can he's already said he's the clerk. He's already winning the rocket. The clerks okay. already have done it. Have a seat. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. This is to show him at the first court of appeals of Texas. I don't know why this person would. He's a deputy uh, assistant. Uh, I guess he forgot. I was trying to inform him. The clerk himself has already come out and stated that there was no. I was just told him I was asking questions that I already knew the answers to. He causing, he's the one causing the problem. I already know what's in the rock here. Yeah. Uh, oh, you finally you don't mind being shown on camera? Okay, I'm here, Prophet Ron Dwayne Whitfield, in the first court of appeals of Texas. In 2006, my dad had already obtained from this court when it was located on the other side of this uh, uh, building, what you see here, structure, the um, course file. He's already paid for that. And during that time, which is how I obtained rockets to know what I already know. Now, I guess it was in this related to uh, Whitfield versus State, docket number 01 00617 CR, criminal case. Uh, with Food versus State, and the docket sheets already reflect that there is no judgment. So why he would tell me that we is a judgment when the clerk himself has already said there is no judgment is beyond one's imagination. This is making me feel uncomfortable in that that's covering up. You should not do that. You know there's nothing on the docket sheet. I, anybody can go online and see that. You were not employed with this uh, court at the time in 1990. Three. Uh, yes. He w Brent, it's going on YouTube and Facebook. Okay, are you okay with that? Oh, well, you, you got on the camera. He's, he's sitting up and what? That's, that's, that's what I've been talking about. I already know that. I told him I already know the answer to the questions. I definitely got to come on now. We already know the, the clerk has already stated that there's no judgment. This is what I've been telling you. And the clerk of the court. I mean, the, the justice writing on the case, they know there's no judgment. Mr. Pryor is not available right now. He's in meetings. Um, so, but we're getting the record and we'll allow you to view it inside the room there. Thank you. She's working on it right now. Okay. Mr. Klein is already stated there is no judgment. It's already all over YouTube, Facebook. The record is what it is. Now you can do your post conviction. Let me see your phone. Pull it up. Go to my uh, YouTube. Let's see. Make it, put it, put it on the knees feet. Uh, 
page 11 and 12. So we want Who was the judge here then? His name was uh, Thomas, whatever. So you want to enlarge this? Let me see your phone. Take a picture of this. You don't have to. Let me see. I think can you minimize it? No, leave it there. Click on it. Okay. Okay. okay, you're not done. Get the other half of it. Well, actually, I can just he can just give it to me. I want a twenty cent a page. So this I have. This I have. Yeah, but he's already, my dad had already bought the file. Plus, uh, these records go to the state uh, library. I, you can get copies from them then, there, and also, uh, he's already, uh, then they go to the clerk's record across the street. Mm -hmm. So, uh, we already know there's no judgment. On that on your case. Yeah. Yeah. So let me see a pen. So write down uh, this page. I mean, and a little piece of paper. I don't know what this is. That should open. No, just a piece of paper. to write this down? Look in your purse. How much trash you have? So this is from. I don't know. We got two computers here. So this is from. Uh, I mean, this shows to be what 19 page 19 through Come take a picture of this. This, this one? Right here. It's so beautiful, but I think you can focus in on it. Let's see if I can see it. 
pages. Okay, take a picture before I waste shot. So they can see it's coming from the first quarter of the Of both computers? No, just the other one. What is this? Somebody else still. Okay, um, from this record, from the transcript. All right, let's go. Excuse me. Yes, sir. Uh, I'd like to purchase uh, from the transcript uh, pages 19 through 24. Okay. 
And that's it? Yes. <laughs>